Hey, this is Hugo at Expert Village. This next segment is on scent. Now, a deer, I'm just looking at this, this skull that we found in the woods of a six-point buck, and I was looking at the nasal cavity. It's just amazing, all the surface area in there. I was thinking just the tissue there, it, the, their, their ability to smell a hunter is, is such an important thing because for us as hunters, it's going to be one of the greatest challenges we have. There are a lot of different products out on the market today that help conceal the smells that we pick up and that we have um, from soaps to body washes to things you can wash your clothes in to charcoal suits to to send away sprays all kind of things like that to mask scent another thing that you may want to consider using when we're talking about scents is things that attract deer during the rut you may want to use um, estrus in canisters or different things like that 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 if a deer smells it, then they think that there's a deer in the area and they'll come check it out. Um, but the main thing is that we want to be aware of, of the smell factor, of how we smell and how a deer senses us through that and act accordingly, whether it's washing or the clothes that we have on or just being aware of wind direction. Um, that still is the name of the game. That's still one of the most important things that we can do is know the direction of the wind, check it constantly, and know that generally speaking deer that are coming down when will be able to smell you and so um, just be aware of that be aware of that as a hunter and it'll make you um, a better hunter and also ready for uh, a deer to come out at any time